A state auction causes a stir, attracting a crowd of more than 50 protesters. One protester was arrested in demonstrations in front of Constitution Hall this morning. Yeah, demonstrators say they're upset Michigan is auctioning off more than 100,000 acres of land to be used for fracking. Now that's a process used to extract natural gas from underground. Christina Fan spoke with demonstrators and has more. For hours today, these protesters chanted their message to anyone who would listen, hoping to stop fracking in Michigan. The whole life cycle of obtaining natural gas is just as bad for climate change as coal, so it is not the transition fuel to the future that many were proclaiming it was. Many protesters took drastic measures. Some were even willing to be arrested by police for disrupting the auction. Others circulated petitions. We're trying to get a temporary restraining order from a judge in Ingham County today to see if they would uh, suspend granting any other permits for frack wells. But state officials say with strict regulations and guidelines, oil and gas drilling poses little threat to the environment. And it's never been shown to have any kind of an environmental harm to the state of Michigan. We have a really good regulatory program in this state. This is the first year the auction drew a crowd of protesters worried after fracking contaminated water supplies in other states. But Werfel says that's not a concern here. Hydraulic fracturing has been used in Michigan for over 50 years. Uh, more than 12,000 gas and oil wells around the state have been hydraulically fractured. It's a common practice. A common practice that goes way back into Michigan history, but one that these protesters want to see changed. From Lansing, Christina Fan, 6 News.